What the hell happened to Television 3? <clears throat> Why am I making this? Well, look what's going on with TV. Rider's Strike is kicking some ass. Some serious ass. You know, no new k I guess I was right. k may be done for. Uh, no new heroes, maybe till next year. Uh, they got new ep- two new episodes of Chuck coming up, which I'm shocked by. But you know what really kicked me in my balls? They made Terminator into a television series. What the fuck are they thinking? Not only is it somewhat at- may or may not be out of continuity, but what kind of fucking sense does that make? You can't milk the Terminator franchise. It's illogical. That is a bad move. That is a waste of time and money. They could be, you know, trying to save their cop show, Cavill. Now, if they were going to make Ter- Terminator into a television series, one, they should have done it years ago. And two, it wouldn't be on Fox. It would be on a sci-fi channel. What the hell are, is their problem? Whew. Desperate Housewives is still on. That's on his way out the door. I hope so. Swear to God, I hope so. Yeah, you know, Reapers and reruns. Pretty much everything's in reruns tonight, right now. And I saw a new episode of Family Guy. And if you haven't, if you ever look up a video called Family Guy Sucks, I forgot the guy's name. I'll get back to you on that. But he hit some points, and I was watching Family Guy, and he was right about it. Now, for the most part, though, it's the way it is because Fox decided to edit and put together unfinished episodes without Seth MacFarlane's permission because he's part of the writer's strike right now. Which is why Family Guy might suck for the next few weeks. Again, this is a case of, you know, the suits not letting the creators do what they do. Create. Um, which is why everything's going down a toilet now. Everybody's trying to step in and you know, people who have no, who are not even part of the creative process step in and say it sucks. We, and they don't even give it a half a chance. That's why right now we're living on something I call, um, reliving the glory days. You know, they're going back, they're trying to rehash old ideas that knocked it out the park the last few times. I mean, you know, just like CBS has all these sitcoms. Now, Two and a Half Men is pretty interesting. You know, it, it, it's all right, but, you know, they, they got shows like How I Met Your Mother, which is pretty much basically another Friends ripoff, which meant, doesn't make any sense. You know, nobody's life, is, you know, situation comedy, I know it's fiction, but nobody's dating life, it, it, it's not that zany, I don't think. Mine isn't. I don't know about yours, but mine isn't. Um... You know, Fox has that, you know, one show, Kelsey Grammer, where he's like a news anchor at a news station and the funny things happen. What was that show called? WKRP in Cincinnati, I think, if I'm not mistaken. You know, they've already done that. Now, if you want to talk about a good sitcom, I say it again. George Lopez is a great show. I still watch the reruns because it's a really awesome show. I don't even know why it got canceled. You know, it pissed me off. It really does. You know, I don't know what's going to happen to Heroes. Um, I think Hopefully, Girlfriends will finally get, go off the air because the way it, the way it is now is just, uh, uh, it's just sad. It's just really sad. Um, let's see. MTV sucks still. Too many reality shows. Not enough music. Of, you know, MTV should stand for meaningless television because they have no meaning to what they're putting on there. You know, the only thing wa- interesting to watch nowadays is like TMZ with celebrities loot going crazy, you know. And, you know, I'm pretty much bored with television. I mean, there's there's nothing on. There's, I'm cutting on the TV now. There's nothing on but a George Lopez rerun. You know, it's 1230. You know. Um, and, you know, it's, <laughs> it's funny. Hold on a second. Oh, that's funny. George Lopez is funny. But, uh, you know, TV just sucks, you guys. I mean, 
I don't know what to say. I'm ho- I feel like shit. I mean, you know, thank God for YouTube, man, because without YouTube, I lose my fucking mind. There's nothing to watch, you know. But now I'm beating a dead horse, just like those people that are trying to make Star Trek into a movie. Well, that's about it. Just like all trilogies, the third one is always the weakest. So, uh, you know, post your comments and uh, I'll hit y'all back. Peace.